Hey Sunshines, it's I Favor Grace and I'm coming at you today with a really quick video because I got some new goodies the other day um, from Walmart and CVS and I wanted to just let you guys know what I have and I'm um, doing a little review to see how they work. I'm going to use each product, one on one side of my face and one on the other side and um, at the end of the night or when I get back in the house from hanging out or whatever, I'm going to let you guys know how they work. The first thing I have is the Hard Candy Fast and Fabulous Setting Spray. Um, this one was about seven bucks and I got it at Walmart. It was six dollars, but it ended up being about seven something with taxes and everything. Um, it says a weightless spray that locks in makeup for all day wear. Um, spray over foundation, eyeshadow, blush, and concealer to set your makeup look. It says this works in the worst weather, which I'm really excited to use this one today because the weather here in Alabama where I am is horrible. It's been raining off and on all day, all week, all weekend. So I'm going to be outdoors. Um, I'm basically going to what would really be considered like a barbecue, but not a barbecue. But anyway... I'm gonna use this and I'm gonna see how it holds up and I'm going to also use the Wet n Wild Photo Focus um, finishing spray. This one says all day wear as well. I saw a review on this one and the girl that used it said it was okay for the price. It was about $5. I got it at CVS. But this one smells really weird to me. Um, it's really strong and it almost like burns my nose if I spray too much of it. I've actually sprayed this one on this side of my face and this side of my face actually still kind of looks wet to me. So I guess it's taken a while to dry. Um, I have not sprayed the hard candy on this side of my face yet. So I'm about to do that. The spray on this one is easy. It does come out... Um, like a full spray it's not like it shoots out at you but you want to hold it back some from your face so that you don't get those large drops in some areas you want to get a full spray um this one it comes out fine too it's a fine mist and it doesn't have that weird smell that the wet and wild one has but i'm gonna spray this on now so that you guys can see okay that was three pumps and it does not have that um, strong scented alcohol smell like the Wet n Wild one does. So that's one thing that I already don't like about the Wet n Wild spray. Hopefully it dries fast too. This was the Hard Candy Fast and Fabulous and it doesn't smell bad at all. It's not burning my nose. When I sprayed the Wet n Wild one, I was like literally in here almost choking. So those are the first two items that I have. And the last thing I have is the Black Radiance True Complexion Contour Palette. I was really excited about this because I haven't used the contour palette. I normally just use the LA Girl Pro Concealer HD Pro Conceal in the color Dark Cocoa, which I did use this today as well. But I went back in with the True Complexion Contour Palette and I used the Sculpt. I used the contour just to give my contour a little bit more depth and I used the highlight which I thought was really pretty but it's not really picking up that good on camera maybe I should use a little bit more actually the hard candy fast and finish is already almost dry I can tell my forehead is still wet I guess the most of it went on my forehead but as far as my face it's dry and the wet and wild photo focus it's it looks like this I can already see a difference actually um, maybe I'm just being dramatic, but it seems like I can see a difference already. Okay, so those are my new products that I have. I'm getting ready to get dressed and go on out. So I'll be out all evening. It's like 4 or 5 o'clock here. So um, I'm going to see how both of these work. I will come back and let you guys know. And I'm also going to be doing a cap and gown DIY um, tutorial as well because I do have graduation coming up in about two weeks yay to the graduates so I'm gonna do a DIY cap and gown video and I'll probably do it tomorrow after I come back and let you guys know how this is or I'll do a two-on-one I'll let you guys know how this was at the beginning and then I'll do the cap and gown tutorial thank you guys so much for watching my video I hope you all enjoyed it I can't wait to get back with you to let you know how these finishing sprays turn out um I can't wait to do my graduation cap tutorial guys for you guys but until then thumbs up and subscribe and until next time don't forget to smile see you guys later bye